Welcome back, everybody. We are back in freeways yet again. This is going to be episode 7. Uh, hopefully, we can get this left-hand side all done. And uh, someone on my last video, or uh, a couple videos ago, sent me a link for the full map of the game. And it looks like once we get this left-hand side done, uh, it will go out one more ring. This map gets pretty big, and we definitely have some more content ahead of us. Uh, let's go ahead and jump in. Okay, so we've got the 11 East. Uh, let's see where that's going. It's going pretty much straight across to the 11 West. 11 West is going pretty much straight across to 11 East. And we just got to hook up all of these side buildings. It looks like we've got basically four construction sites. Uh, but they all do want to connect to each other as well. Um, actually, this should be a good... Uh, candidate. Whoops, I probably need to back this up just a little bit, get us a little closer. Um, this should be a good candidate for a a uh, roundabout junction. Um, I should have looked up what the what they're actually called. Uh, basically, where you have an upper or a lower, depending on how the freeway is configured, um, roundabout as the actual uh, exit and entrance ramp area for the freeway. So basically, we'll probably come off back here. Uh, mm, we don't ha actually have as much room as I was thinking. That might not work. Um, let me clear that real quick. Oh no, so actually what we should do here, because of our limited space, we should have the um, roundabout that I was just talking about be down here so we want to try and have as much room as we can for all these entrances and exits but anyway we'll take our freeway now it'll be a uh, overhead second level and then we'll do the same over here not starting off very strong with our straight lines but oh well so then we'll take our exit ramp we have an entrance ramp over here, and another ramp, and another ramp. Now all we need to do is hook up all of these little construction sites, and they're sending next to no traffic. So having everything this kind of uh, congested should not be too much of a problem. Uh, and then we just need one more thing back here. And that should have been it. I think we might have a problem right here with the purple. Yep, just as I expected. And let's go ahead and run it. And I got a little bit of traffic right there. A bunch of cars came in all at once. Uh, but doing pretty good. 92 kilometers an hour uh, is the average speed. The other factors, 332, not too bad. Uh, pretty good start to this episode. Um, okay, well, nothing difficult here, we're just connecting two roads. So it's going to be all about just keeping the roads as straight as we can to uh, have the highest possible average speed. To get us the highest score. Um... Uh, Okay, well, they're connected. Uh, I guess we don't even have a score for this map. We're literally just connecting that up for no reason. So we could... I guess it's just so you can do whatever you want here. You can maybe, like, uh... There we go. <laughs> there we go. That's pretty cool. Alright, moving on. That was a pretty fast opening to this. Alright, so we've got the 9 Bypass, which is going over to this industrial area, uh, and then a little bit of traffic everywhere else. The 9 Alternative is going down to whatever this is. Let's call this a, um... I don't even know what that... Par a parking lot, I guess? I'm not really sure what that's supposed to be. I don't even really understand what this is. Kind of looks like car doors. Uh, you see, like the window, and then like the bottom part of a car door. I don't, I don't really know. 
This over here, that looks like power lines. So maybe this is like an electrical substation. If those are supposed to be like electrical lines or maybe it is a parking lot. I don't really know. Uh, but anyway, so 9 bypass needs to go over there. 9 alt is coming pretty much straight down. Uh, and then from purple, it's going to green. And from green to the 9 alt. So this is a little... Um, a little bit interesting here. <clears throat> I think the first thing I want to do is actually is actually get purple hooked up, maybe. Uh, it's not the best I could have done there. So come up this way, try and leave us as much room as possible. So we're gonna need a little bit coming over here. All right, so that looks okay for now. Uh, let's hook up the nine bypass, I think. Like that. It'll need just a little offshoot here for the nine alt. It'll also need to get hooked up to green and pink, but it's sending pretty small amount of traffic so I think we might just take it off of here give us a little turnaround point <clears throat> could have had this a little further down giving us a little bit longer of a turnaround uh, but I think this is going to be okay so if we look at 9 alt it needs a hookup down this way and then let's give it a more direct line into this uh, pink building. So we'll do something like that. Uh, it does also need a connection to the 9 bypass. Uh, 9 bypass looks like it's doing okay. And then we've got the pink to go out. Actually, this might be a little too much traffic here for this. Um, We'll have to keep an eye on that. Might block it up a little too much. We need our blue exit. Or uh, the, the exit coming out of our green building, I should say. Uh, so it's going to need a connection back to purple. As well as pink bypass. Uh, okay, so let's try and do this. We're going to need a... Uh, yeah, let's, let's keep this as an upper level for right this moment. And then it needs to come around and hook up over there. Uh, if I had left a little more room, I might have been able to cut over there. Well, let's see if we can still do it. Yeah, I think that'll work. Then we go down. We'll hook up down here. So green is almost done. Let's go ahead and try and hook this up now. Alright, that's all hooked up. Uh, and now all we need is for the bypass. So let's actually come off of that and around like that. Hopefully our cars do not interfere, which it looks like they won't. Uh, this is definitely a little messy. Um, I. I don't think there's quite enough room to do any sort of roundabout, uh, but we may try that if this doesn't work out. But let's go ahead and... Oh, nope, we're missing something. Ah, so we're still missing uh, some of our exits for purple. And we don't have a lot of room, so that's kind of a problem. We may need to redo this and do something with a roundabout uh, to get cars... Uh, going to their correct exits. And you can see we're sort of bottlenecking here a bit. So, okay, so that goes to green. It just needs the exit for the freeways. Um, let's just try something like this for right now. Ooh, that was really sharp. Let's just try that and see what happens. Probably not going to have a very good score, but I don't quite think it'll jam. Uh, so that wasn't too bad. 241. 
Um, I'm not very happy with it. Let's go ahead and clear this. We're going to try something else. Uh, let's get our main things hooked up first. We got the bypass. Uh, okay, actually we can't quite do that yet. Let's do this. We're going to go up. Make a big roundabout. Need to take our bypass. It's going to go up. It's actually going to skirt around the outside. Uh, it's going to come down a little bit more and then back down. So a little tight through there. Um, that that kind of wasted some space, but we can always go back and uh, make things a little tidier if we need to. Let's go ahead and take this. Take the exit here, wrap it around for green. I'm going to take this, shoot it over there so we can get traffic onto this roundabout. Uh, we can probably take one of these and make it, eh, maybe not. Let's see. So we got green needs to go to blue with a dedicated road. So if we want to do that, uh, we are actually pretty tight on space right here with how I did the roundabout. Um, so let's do that. We got to just jump over this road, come back down, and then hook up to the 9 alt. So that's pretty good. Uh, let's see, what else do we need? <clears throat> All right, so the nine alt will need a way over to purple. Uh, those still need purple. I was hoping not to use this roundabout for incoming and outgoing traffic, uh, but it's a little hard to sort of work around that. Because there is a lot of traffic going a lot of places. So if we've got this here, we can bring that around. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, so that would be for purple, and it can also be for green, maybe. So if we take this road here, we'll kind of do what we did last time. Do like that. Give us a little more room. Uh, let's go ahead and take this and it's going to shoot over there for all of our purple and green traffic. And then we're going to have this come this way. Go up. Hook up onto the roundabout. And this will be for our outgoing traffic, I believe, is what I want to do here. So we'll also need that there. I'm going to take this, and it'll come off like that. And then we need... Uh, man, we're very tight on room here. Trying to uh, squeeze some different things in. So, I think we want to try and take this here, go down, and then hook it up to the 9 alt. I'm going to take this exit, like that. Put in another exit over here. All right, let's see where we're at. So the nine bypass needs something to nine alt. We can just do that. And it still needs an entrance to pink. Or, uh, yeah, pink is that's pretty much what that is. This is a purple building, but the cars look pink. So when I said pink, I was confusing myself for just a second there. Uh, it can probably... Eh, maybe not. What are we still missing here? So this needs a lot of different exits. Needs a way into pink. And a way over to blue. There's really not much room left here to work with. Uh, so 9 alt has a direct hookup. Uh, I, th 
think almost the only thing we can do here is take that go down and then hook up into there. So now the bypass is set up, uh, purple exit is set up. We only have a couple more things we need here. But things are getting a little bit chaotic here with all these ramps. So this still needs a way to get to blue, which I thought... No, that should have an exit to blue right through here. So that's... That... I'm not sure why that's not showing a uh, connection to blue here. Yeah, so our traffic comes out of here, comes around, hits this ramp, and then can hit that ramp and be on blue. Oh, there it goes. It just had a little bit of a problem there. And it looks like everything is good. We just need this to get over to purple and green. Which is going to mean another ramp, I believe. Uh, I guess we can just take this and come all the way around. There's not too many other options, really. Alright, so I think we had something like 234. I think this might actually be worse. Um, just because we used a huge amount of concrete. 235. I'm pretty sure that's almost the exact same score. Um... This one's, a, this one's really cramped. Probably utilize the space over here a little bit better. Uh, maybe if we had two different roundabouts. Since we had such a kind of crappy score, I think I'm going to go ahead and clear this. And we're going to try something like that. Nope, and the game decided to mess up. So we're going to redo this. Okay. Let's try and just put in... Whoops. The incoming roundabout down here. Uh, when I start trying... Whenever I try to think about doing the third level for this game, uh, I always it always gets messed up in my head when I should start it. Uh, where my connection should, should be. I'm always thinking about the ground level and the uh, second level. Uh, but as soon as I start trying to think about having like a third level of the roadway above everything, uh, it just kind of gets confusing in my head sometimes. Alright, so that's everything basically coming in. Uh, we do need this here still. Okay, so we're going to leave our direct connections uh, alone for right this moment until we get our second roundabout in. Uh, because our direct connections are most likely going to use uh, some third level flyovers uh, to get around our second level uh, roundabout. Okay, so to do that, I think I'm going to start... Probably here with green. I already know it needs to go there. I'm going to take this, go up. Let's get a roundabout in. Like that. In my head, it looks like this should work. Then as soon as I start doing all the connections, I'm like, oh yeah. So my exit traffic will be on that roundabout, but then how do I get it back down to go to the other buildings? So then I have to think about adding in some little uh, ramps to go from one roundabout down to the other. And it gets a bit messy, and then it doesn't really feel like I'm uh, really saving any space or anything like that by doing it this way. 
instead of just having roads uh, with a bunch of uh, split offs and things. Okay, so from down here we need to get it on to the roundabout, so we'll probably grab it there and come across like that. The 9 bypass is going to be a little bit of a headache, but I think I can sneak it through there. This, um, man. Let's go ahead and grab this and connect it there. We'll come over this way, go up, and hook up there. Uh, that'll need something to blue. We can do something like that for right now. But we'll need a... Well, that's pretty dedicated. That's almost a straight shot for the uh, blue traffic coming out of green. So that's not too bad. Let's actually take this here. Come on to the inside. Go down and then hook up there. And that actually completes the network, I'm a little surprised, uh, but there's still some ramps and uh, flyovers and things we need to put in, um, because you can see traffic is backing up. So that's got a pretty direct connection to green. Uh, to get to pink, it has to go up all the way around, down all the way around, and then into pink, so we don't want that. Uh, we can probably just take... Nope, actually there's not room there. Uh, let's see, I could probably come up here maybe and then down. For blue, it's got a pretty direct connection. Uh, somewhat direct for the 9 bypass. Uh, let's look at green in the... okay, so it's got that. <clears throat> it has to make one half loop around to get to the nine bypass. It's got a direct connection for pink. Uh, and it has to make basically two loops to get down to purple. Which is something we don't want. So if we came off there, we could go down there. Let's get this nine bypass uh, set up first. You can see where it's... Uh, really hurting things right now. I'm going to try and start back as far as we possibly can. Go up. And we're actually just going to go around everything. Uh, come over here and then come back down. So that should help there. Uh, it's got a nice little thing right there to blue. Uh, can get around to pink and green fairly easily. The 9 alt is our next uh, problem area. And then actually I should have done it first because now uh, I've basically gotten rid of the space I needed for the 9 alt uh, to have a direct connection. But as you can see the 9 bypass incoming traffic is pretty much completely alleviated now. So hopefully this here uh, will go down in traffic a little bit. Uh, so over here we've got a bunch of orange. Uh, it's got to go around the circle onto there and then just cut over. I'm trying to see where some of this traffic is, why it's going so slow right through here. So it looks like a lot of it is the green having a problem. Uh, pink traffic is a problem. It needs to have something a little more dedicated. Because all that pink traffic has to go around and around. So we're just going to take this ramp here. Come down and hook it up there. That way we're trying to keep as much traffic out of the roundabout as possible. Uh, and basically just trying to use it to uh, switch things over to different areas. The blue is a little bit of a problem. Just because it's slowing down everything. Uh, I mean, the only thing I could do is just put a little bypass right through there. But it, it almost doesn't save us anything because this is only going one exit. And it's almost a straight shot. 
So as you can see, the, the traffic has actually died down quite a bit. Um, we're just getting a little bit right here where everything has to merge and then down here where everything is merging again. Uh, but that pink traffic now um, should only be coming from... Oh no, okay, so yeah. So now if we run it, it should be pretty smooth. Yeah, that, I mean, visually, it looks like it's running a lot smoother than our previous attempts. Uh, but only 275, so not that big of an improvement. Um, but I feel like this is a better setup, even if it is a little more chaotic in areas. So that's not too bad. I feel like there could be a higher score there, but we're going to move on. Okay, so we got a lot of roads here. Got the 100 north is actually only going right there. 100 south is only going right there, so that's pretty nice. Um, we got the 9 that is splitting up between the 9 bypasses and 9 south. Uh, 9 bypass doing the same type of stuff. Uh, and if we take a look at it, go away. If we take a look at it, um, there's a fair amount of traffic, but it's not excessive. Wait, that's weird. None of these are connecting over to the 100, the uh, 100. So they're literally just their own thing over here. It's a little odd, but okay. Which I guess we couldn't actually uh, get any traffic over there. Uh, with this power lines or whatever in the way. Because even with a second level uh, or third level, we can't get through that. So that's a little odd. Just a little bit of freeway over there. Alright, so we might be able to do kind of a dumbbell. Pretty sure this is not going to work. I'm going to go ahead and connect this up over here so we can give it a test. Yeah, not good. And it's going to jam up now. Yep. So that doesn't work. Which I should have thought that it wouldn't, but okay. Uh, let's try and just do one big sort of roundabout. That's, I don't know why I'm so fixated on trying to make roundabouts work when they don't like to a lot of the time. But, still want to do it. Let's run it. Hopefully it doesn't jam up. It doesn't look like it's going to. Uh, getting a little bit of slowdowns for sure. Ooh, it almost jammed. That's actually very close to jamming. Uh, so we've got that orange traffic. Could use <clears throat> from the 9 down to the 9 bypass. Uh, we could probably use a dedicated ramp. I don't know if I can actually fit it in. Uh, let's try it. Yeah, maybe I can. Yeah, so I think if we do that, so 306, let's see if that helps our traffic at all. Oh, it's really not sending that much. Uh, well, 305, a little bit better. Yeah, it's kind of a weird setup, but I think we're going to take it. All right, moving right along. Okay, so we got the 9. We've got the 9 South power plant. Power plant is only going to 100 South, so that's kind of nice. And we've got the Coast Highway, which is our main uh, thing with that blue with uh, traffic going to 9 South. And the 9 is sending... It's... I don't know, it's kind of like a... it's... yeah. These three are sending a decent amount of traffic to each. Uh, 100 South is sending just a little bit. So I think there is a three-way stack interchange. Let me actually see if I can put this in. So, let's take this here. Do that. And that. Oh, and I've already messed it up. That's not how that works. Uh, clear it. 
All right, so we have this one coming this way. Ooh. Very short on room here, so we gotta make up, or uh, make use of every inch that we can. Uh, so we need this here. This is gonna be really weird looking, um, but I'm sort of following how a three-way stack interchange is set up. So then it would come from here to there, like that. Uh, from back here to over there. Uh, but we will need a little room for this 100 south hookup. But I think we can get away with it through here. So we'll go up, make the turn. And then uh, merge it up. And then, ooh, I should have done this side first. Uh, we'll have to start over here, go up, go around, and then come down. Okay, so that's pretty good. That's good. That is good. That's actually not too bad. Uh, and that needs to get over to 100 South. So it needs to jump across and hook up here. If I can get my mouse in here and click the right thing. Yes. Alright, so we'll go up. It'll hook up there. We're going to want a little uh, shoot off here. Whoops, go down. Whoa, got a little wavy there. Uh, the Coast Highway can just sort of meet up there. That's good. That is all good. All we need to hook up now is uh, 100 South. So we can just go ahead and bring that up. That can now get to both of those. And then um, it's sending a tiny amount of traffic. Uh, let's just do a turnaround. Yeah, that, that should be more than good enough. Yeah, that's that's nice. There's actually probably... Like this here, uh, we probably could have put it onto here and then had it turn around down here and also eliminated this. A um, couple different options we had. Oh, actually, no, that's sending out so low traffic I could have connected it right there. No, that wouldn't have worked. Yeah, I, this could possibly be uh, made a little bit more simplistic but I don't think there's too much more I could have done it actually and it looks pretty nice I like how it is uh, we're gonna take that 320 and uh, move on all right so we got the north road one east and a bunch of little housing areas oh and one west so this is another one oh uh hold on, let me go back up to the map I feel like we've already had one like that. Uh, eh, maybe not. That's weird. I thought we already had a map that was like that. Maybe I'm thinking of this one? I'm not sure. Uh, it actually might be this one I'm thinking of. Okay. So, kind of splits off those ways. Uh, I think we're just going to have to go with a dumbbell. There we go. Uh, this is going to jam. Yep. So, that doesn't work. Let's go ahead and clear it. It's very strange. My computer's getting a bit laggy all of a sudden. Okay. So... For everything is sending basically the same amount of traffic everywhere. So if we do a roundabout for incoming, ooh, I overshot that.
and then we do a roundabout for all the outgoing. Oh, I still need this to get hooked up. Whoops. Kind of messed that up. Uh, but anyway, so take this over here. Take this over here. Uh, oh, I'll need one here. Ramp. Uh, this is not my best work. Okay, so that still needs a way to get over there. Yeah, this is not my... my best work here. Man, that's just too much traffic coming into this one point. Dang it. Alright, what are we missing? Uh, that needs a exit over there. That's good, that's good. Uh, that just needs a way to get into blue. That needs to go to pink and blue. So we can do that. Let's go all the way around to get over there. Not ideal. Um, let's just jump that across. Yeah, screw it. We'll just do that. Network complete. I don't think it'll jam up like this, but it might not be the uh, most efficient setup. Yeah, 320, it's not maybe as terrible as I thought it would be. Yeah, uh, it's not that bad. Um, I, I still need to figure out how to do this with the two roundabouts, where one is basically acting as our input switcher. So you have all of your uh, like your incoming roads hooked up to it, and then its outputs go to the inputs of your buildings, uh, or your sinks. And then we have a second roundabout that takes, um, the outputs from your buildings, and its outputs then go to the outputs, uh, for your roads. But then it gets a little messy when the buildings want to connect to each other. So then you end up having to use either your um, incoming roundabout for your switching between buildings, or you have to use your output, uh, your outgoing roundabout as your switcher between buildings. And then that's when you get where this is all real bad, uh, because then you just have a lot of crossovers and uh, a lot of usage on one or the other. But this isn't too bad, it's just when this map seems to go in waves more than a constant stream of traffic. Uh, so then you get the um, slowdowns because it's not, it's it's all at once basically for the traffic. But yeah, 320, that's not that bad and we got one more square to do today. Alright, North Road, 64 East, uh, one East West and then two buildings, two uh, residential areas. So it looks like green, oh, and we don't have multiple levels in this uh, map. And that's one of the things, that's probably the hardest thing with this game, 
is the few maps where you're limited to ground level only. Uh, that makes things a lot more tricky. And again, I want to use a roundabout here just because we have so much traffic going everywhere. But we're going to start off hooking some things directly up. I also feel like I've done this map before. It's very familiar. Maybe this was... Maybe I did do this? Oh, that's right. The left-hand side of the map. I forgot. On the uh, left-hand side of the map, I had tried to do that a few episodes ago. Um, and I came back and said that I wasn't actually able to complete any of them. Because they were really tricky. That's why a couple of these have looked familiar now. Uh, so I guess it's a good thing that I've been able to get through them so far, and now we're down to the last one. Um, I guess I have actually learned something playing this game. Okay, so we got this here. And it needs to go that way. I don't really know a better way of doing that. Uh, man. This, so yeah, this one's gonna be difficult. I think when I did this... Originally, I tried to do like a roundabout up here and another one down here and have things like going past each other. I also tried using like all of the map space to get roads uh, to have as much room as I could for traffic to back up before crossing points um, just to sort of cheat it so that it wouldn't jam up before the timer ended, but it would always eventually jam up. Um, yeah. So it's going to be a little bit tricky, that's for sure. Alright, so... That needs to get over to blue. Let's give it its own little dedicated thing here. And it also... Okay, well it can go there and then there. So that works. Uh, we can bring this down here. And then, I guess like that. We don't have too much choice. Okay, why is that not connecting? There we go. Oh god, this is gonna be absolutely terrible. Bring this down here. Try and use that for our blue and purple. Good god. I already know this is going to be terrible. Oh, don't jam. Wow, I'm honestly surprised that... Holy crap, and I beat the 200? Wow, i am gotten much better at this game, apparently. Either that or that was just a complete, like, lucky fluke. Okay. Well, 274. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. I'm really, I guess, I don't know. There's just not as much traffic as it makes it look like. Uh, but anyway, I want to check out this picture. <laughs> okay, that's funny. Uh, that's a terrible, I mean, I guess it's not too much different than what we've got here. we got this down here, and then, huh. Okay, well. Uh, I guess that's the left side of the map done. Yeah, as you can see. So here we go. Now I've got my world efficiency score uh, because I'm on the final ring. And uh, we got one, 32 more squares to do here. Uh, so not 56 like I initially thought, but 32. And then we'll be done with freeways. But yeah, it's been pretty interesting so far. I am honestly surprised at how fast I went through this left-hand side. Uh, and had, like, almost no problem with it. Uh, especially since I couldn't even beat it a long time ago when I had originally tried it. But yeah, so that's going to do it for episode 7, guys. I hope you liked this video. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends, and I'll see all of you in the next one.